so boys and girls, as you can tell, I'm creating a name tag for my accordion fold Giorgio O'Keefe style painting. And to do that, I started with folding my red paper in half. And after folded it in, folding it in half, I started creating a picture frame with a pencil. And now I'm starting to outline all of those designs, including the very, very edge of this paper. So on my picture frame, I have some diagonal lines. I also have some vertical lines and zigzags going around the edge and I've placed my name inside. And one thing that tells everyone about you. So I've added a paintbrush to sh share with everyone that I'm an artist. So in addition to making a beautiful name tag, we are going to embellish it with fringe. So I cut 10 lines and curled, curled, curled. And now I'm going to attach my accordion fold painting to a blue picture frame. So it depends on the class that you're in of what color of picture frame that we're going to be using but I'm only placing blue on the areas that are going to touch that paper. And so you're gonna see that the folded areas will be the only parts that touch. And I had to add a bit extra glue in those places where the glue was sliding down the ridge. So I'm going to straighten out my painting. And after I've straightened it out and aligned it the way that I would like to see it, I'm carefully adjusting and I'm placing my fingers down in each of the crevices, making sure I don't press down the mountain tops of the painting. Because if I press them down, they will become flat and you won't be able to see two paintings at a time. Our whole point of creating these zigzag patterns or accordion folded painting is so we are able to view two paintings at, time, at a time. So I'm gently holding this paper in place and I will grab my name tag, four dots of glue, and I will place my name tag next to my art. Enjoy making your art beautiful today by adding a frame and an ornate name tag.